Uh, how y'all doing, man? I know, I know, I've been off of this for for a quick little minute, but I see it's a lot of people being woke up now, you know. And there's some like me who's waking up enough and can see a lot that's going on. But I, I'm sitting here. And this is not, this is not to, how can I say it? This is not to cause problems. This is to state facts, though, from from research done and other shit, you feel me? God's divine plan of life. Our life doesn't involve law enforcement at all. There was no need for law enforcement. So, I hear you saying, keep the peace. That's all we need to do is keep the peace between our people. We have to quit hating, quit being jealous, and let the next man, let the next man show you how to, how to do something without you hating him. Because he did something that you didn't do. But as far as law enforcement, they have never been nice to us. No matter how peaceful you are with law enforcement, they don't give a fuck about you. They run the business. They are part of a business. And the business needs to lock up as many black people, as many people from the hood. They need to lock your ass up so they can be paid. If they don't pay the white man, they don't get paid. If they don't make, if they don't make that man enough money, they don't get paid. So that's where you got people like, like you hear him talking about the Rothschilds or whoever, you feel me, who ran America. You got these people who put money in on these jails, Bob Barker, Will of Fortune, you feel me, these type of people put their money, they invest money into the jail and nobody really knew why. When you go to CCC and you look at your motherfucking jumpsuit, that bitch say Bob Barker on it. So if the police don't lock y'all up enough, Bob Barker don't get fucking paid. You see what I'm saying? Bob Barker need y'all to fill them jumpsuits. So if you if you increasing the peace with the police, then that means they know that you're gonna give them exactly what you want. You gotta know your rights. That's what this shit is all about. Knowing your motherfucking rights. I know my rights. I am a, 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 a aboriginal and uh, 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 I, I don't I can't even say ancestor because I my soul is an ancestor. But I'm a descendant of the aboriginals. The 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 original natives of this land that they call the USA. I like to call it the USS. And your life that you live in is fake. Y'all don't pay attention to the shit that's been going on around y'all. But like Falonzo been telling y'all, this shit is finna be over with. This shit is finna be over with. Real deal. I know my purpose in life. God been talking to me. So I, I really know my purpose in life. I, I really understand life. For anybody who has been killed, they didn't make it in the future. Meaning that, meaning that yourself, yourself let yourself down in the future. In the future, you did something that yourself didn't like. And so you was killed off. Somebody got close enough to you and killed you off. I understand that much about life. And so, with me, I always been a loner. Everybody know that I don't give a fuck about no niggas being around me. I tried, but I don't care about niggas being around me. I'd rather be around myself because I speak about it in my music. Nigga, I'd rather be solo before niggas snitch on me. 
Before a nigga send me to jail, I'd rather sit by myself, my nigga. That's what I do. If my family ain't here, I'm sitting by myself, my nigga, and it's me and God. I be talking to God all day. So God told me to make this video. And what I'm going to do with this is I'm going to post it. I'm going to tag Falonzo. I wasn't going to even tag him. But since I said his name in here, I'm going to tag him, you feel me? This is no part of problems. This is a, a, a conscious person trying to work with another conscious person. If I can help, I help. But see, a lot of people don't like help. I was one. And I got I got here and I got everything I got off of self. Best thing I can come with right now in my mind. And I'm a I'ma say it and I don't mean to throw shade. But a man who stays in an apartment can't show you how to own a house. Take that for what you take it for. I sit in a house. And I own it. <laughs> I can show you how to do it. That's the type of person I am. I've been trying to reach out and touch somebody, but it took it took God to use a popular person for people to start seeing life. Since I'm not popular in the city, it didn't work when I did it. So I appreciate God and I appreciate Falonzo. Hit me up. Check out my videos. You can go back in my videos and my history, man. All my videos there, man.